What's up, chat? We are back. Take it on the Raiders this week. This is technically episode five of this package rebuild here on TFG Plays. If you're watching this after the fact on YouTube, please do hit that like button. If you're joining me here on Twitch, thank you. This is gonna be a lot of fun. This has been one of my more fun rebuilds that we've done so far. Um, let's take a look at our stats. So Rogers, after all this kind of rocky start, is actually first in the NFL in passing yards. He is now up to 14 touchdowns to five interceptions after a rocky start, to say the least. So uh, he seems to have a fire lit under him with Jordan Love coming in here. The rushing game is getting interesting. A.J. Dillon unlocked star potential last week. He has taken over as the technically number one running back. Aaron Jones is the third down guy. It's a total split here, but let's just say A.J. Dillon is um, becoming a factor here more than we thought the second round pick would. Of course, Austin Prohl is a big reason that this has been such a fun rebuild. Uh, we pick him up off the street coming over from the XFL where he was really good for the Seattle Dragons, and he's been a slot supreme. Now, uh, a good comment that 14 is actually Don Hudson's number, so for the second time this season, we are going to change his number to number 11, and that's going to do it there for his number changes on the season. And then uh, let's actually take a peek at our defense because Rashawn Gary has been another great narrative. Christian Kirksey already 52 tackles, channeling his inner Martinez. And uh, yeah, Rashawn Gary, five sacks. He's off to a great start uh, in year two. We do need this defense as far as the pass defense to kind of pick it up a little bit, but things are going well here in Green Bay after a rocky off season. LaFleur kind of proving guys wrong, even though I've taken over as GM. All right, so week seven, we're gonna do our upgrades, do our scouting, take a look at negotiations, and then we have one fourth quarter only playage remaining. We have the opportunity to play every breakout scenario and then every divisional game, we do full play the moments. Uh, so Let's, let's knock these out and then hop into that. I don't think I'm gonna play against the Raiders. This might be our first full sim. I'm actually gonna go slot for Josh Jackson. Just gonna slide this a little bit so that I can see the chat. All right, let's do negotiations. I went a little too far, now it's blocking my screen. Corey Lindsley, we definitely wanna keep around. He wants three years, 30 mil. I think that's pretty fair. It's going to eat up pretty much all of our cap space, but I think he is definitely a priority, especially when I look at the rest of these guys. We are going to want to lock up Austin Prohl. We'll look into um, potential trade when we get deeper into the season, but uh, locking up Corey Lindsley, I think, definitely got to be a priority for us. So we're going to do that. Three years, 30 million. Hopefully he likes this. Oh, it actually went down, I see. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have to deal with all of our re-signings in the offseason then. So we'll kick all those back. If we franchise tag them, we will. Um, scouting. Let's take a look at the wide receivers a little more. All right. So yeah, I think we're gonna simulate this week against the Raiders. I do wanna make sure that uh, we don't miss any relocation stuff for these teams. Does not look like it. But I think this is a safe week to sim. So there we go. And we won 42 to 31. Wow, and the division's falling apart. We're gonna clinch in like two weeks at this rate. So let's take a look at... Wow, Rodgers. He's going off. AJ Dillon was excellent, 100 yard game. Devontae Adams, holy hell. 
Austin Pearl continues to play well. Defensively, Preston Smith gets a sack, a pick for Darnell Savage. Yeah, man, Rodgers MVP season. That's right, Darth Radonis. I like the Star Wars reference, by the way. So... I can only imagine he won... Oh, Devontae Adams wins Offense Player of the Week. So I think this is a great week to use our fourth quarter playage on against Pat Mahomes and the Chiefs after we just sim that week against the Raiders. Let's do our scouting. I want to take a peek at the corners. So six and one. I want to take a look as well, make sure we're not missing the... Uh, Relocation stuff. Nope. Things are going well in Oakland. Upgrades. Ty Summers, John Runyon. So the defense is certainly struggling, but the offense is just carrying this team right now. Did DeAndre Baker have off-field issues in college? Um, no, not that I know of. So let's go ahead and have our first playage of the night. It's going to be a fourth quarter against Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs. Whether we need it or not. Oh yeah, there will be a second season. You better believe it. <sighs> Gotta hydrate. Yeah, Nick, your Super Bowl and TFGO was nuts. I did not see you losing that lead. All right, let's go ahead to the fourth quarter here. There you go, good job offense. Good game. 12 7. Good job. Oh, we're going to have an interesting fourth quarter, it would look like. Oh, geez, we're going to have to lead a pretty major comeback. Talk about uh, blowing leads here. All right, a two score game. Here we go. We are on defense, and they are close to field goal range. Bit D, Preston Smith. We have got to hold them. Oh. Good play. Classic Andy Reid. All right, we're going to at least give up a field goal here. Let's just, if we're going to get a stop, let's do it quickly at least. There's a sack. Rashawn Gary, that's number six on the year. Let's go. Good job, dude. Looking good at number 99. Gosh, good run. 14-yard run on second and 15. Protect the sticks, guys. Come on. Out of bounds. All right. Oh, that was not a touchdown. Oh, they're challenging it? Yeah, right. Oh, my. Wait. What the hell happened? They went for it? What the hell? <laughs> I didn't feel like playing the field goal, so I... Stupid. That's all right, we'll come back. Plenty of time. I don't love this.
Oh, hold on to the ball, Sternberger. Come on. Don't be a wimp. Uh, this will probably get posted on YouTube throughout tomorrow and Sunday. I'm doing my Panthers rebuild on that franchise guy tomorrow. So I don't know how much of this I'll get edited up tomorrow, but soon. Oh, there you go, Adams. <laughs> Rodgers has not thrown a pick today. God, Dylan just, he, I know size and weight doesn't always matter in this game, but Dylan, when you run with him, he just kind of feels sturdy. Who, God, AJ Prohl, <laughs> he is unbelievable. I don't know what it is about him, but. God, get your feet in, St. Brown. Come on. Rodgers can't throw that any better on the move. Got the backups in there. Way to sit down right there. I think he was supposed to run an out route, but maybe it was an option route. I'm not sure, but. All right. I know we didn't bear well and he simmed the special teams last time, but that's a great drive. So apparently all this offense needs is some AJs. AJ Dillon, AJ Prohl. Oh, God. Get back, get back, get back. I have not heard the conference call yet, but I want to. Rogers on a conference call, right? What, uh, you tell me your thoughts. Oh, you're right, it's Austin Prohl, not AJ Prohl. Uh, I only played football in high school. I was an offensive lineman. Good D. Good job, Kenny Clark. All right, we got it back. Good return, Tyler Irvin. Good run. Thanks for the block, Austin Prohl. The dude does everything. St. Brown's got a chance if uh, Matthew's going to come in. Uh, he's... Uh. Oh, do we have a visitor? No. All right. Sorry. Just got to assess something. All right. Back to business. Oh, it's a bad read. Terrible read. Ah! I blame TFGF. She cut off my... Cut off my rhythm. Damn. That was getting exciting. I thought the uh, I thought the slot was gonna come down on the flat. Good D. It's not over yet, guys. It's not over yet. We got all our timeouts. Make a tackle. Good job. Good job. Is that? Uh, I thought it was Valdez Scantling. Same. Same jersey number and the double name. All right, this is a big play right here. Shannon Sullivan, let's go house it. Oh, all right. Right back in the game. It's like nothing ever happened.
No, I guess not. He can use mine. Ah, what am I doing? Go, go, go. I liked the, uh, I liked the look, but gotta be more conscious of the clock. See if we can get one more off here. I can run it here because it's two minute warning. No! Aaron Jones, dude, that is the second time you fumbled in crunch time. Dude, Aaron Jones is out of here. That is twice now he's fumbled in crunch time this year. Yikes. He's fumbling on purpose because he's mad at the team. <laughs> Gosh, we had a real chance if we didn't fumble the ball there. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. Uh, we, I don't, I can't tell you how long we're going to go, bro. But check out my Panthers rebuild on YouTube. I go through all the, all the settings. It's all the same. God, I thought Pro was going to fumble there for a second. God. Did he catch that? Oh, I thought he caught it. Willie Gay just running stride for stride with Austin Prohl. So good. Jesus, Rogers. <laughs> Not Aaron's best fourth quarter. Say that much. washed yeah right he's still having an mvp season it's not his fault aaron jones fumbled his comeback effort efforts away oh are you serious how did that get picked to carry his keys are you kidding me get out of here Ugh, disappointing night in a lot of ways rogers throws a couple picks but he's still having an mvp season we're, we're all right we need Equinomia St. Brown to body out that corner there. That's embarrassing. Thanks for the follow, brother. All right, so... Not really much to speak of. Defensively, Gary did have a sack. We got a pick from Shannon Sullivan there. Darth Radonis, appreciate it, bro. Thanks for gifting the subs. Thanks for the sub, college football guy. Uh, I'm gonna spend, geez, you guys are coming in. Oh, those are all the, uh, the gifted subs. All right, let's advance. We're still six and two, guys, we're fine. Let me see if there's uh, stadium stuff. What week? Uh, what week do you pick your stadium and stuff? I'm just waiting on that so I can retire these uh, second teams. You'd think you'd pick it before like November, you know? <laughs> Give them six months to put the whole team, the whole stadium together. So scouting, we gotta scout running backs because Aaron Jones is bye-bye. No, week five is pick, um, is where you pick the relocation. And I already did that for, uh, for Oakland. All right, so we're simming this week against the Chargers. All we have is any breakouts. Definitely not making any trades. I think we're in pretty good shape. Oh man, we lost the Chargers just like real life. 
pretty similar score too, 27-16. We, we do not have a lot of opportunities to play here. We're going to have to keep simulating. We do have a run of um, division games though, the last three games of the season. It's probably going to be simming up until that point unless we get any breakouts. Jordan Love got in. Rodgers throws three picks. What the hell? He's been uh, he's been really roller coaster this year. Adams is going off. Proles keeping up, but geez, Rodgers. Two weeks ago we were talking about you as the MVP. Now it's like, what's going on, man? Okay, we are gonna sim this week. I think we've done enough scouting. I'm gonna put that on auto. Jordan Love gets a gets an upgrade. Love, we are going to go with Field General because I want you to get awareness. I want you to get accuracy. Simon Stepniak. All right, one more week of scouting. We don't really need to scout offensive linemen. Let's scout uh, middle linebackers. Good class for linebackers. Yeah, the NCAA scouting was sweet. All right, come on, beat Carolina. It's in Lambeau. We've lost some tough ones in a row. Let's not lose before the bye week here. Good grief. Back-to-back -back weeks. Rodgers, what the... What is going on? He's trying to lose his job. Austin Prohl's even quieted off here. Christian Kirksey's gonna finish with like 5,000 tackles though, channeling his inner Blake Martinez. All right, I wanna do my uh, coach XP here. Uh, no, we are not uh, relaxing this week. We are gonna take extra preparation this week because I don't know what the hell's going on, but we can't keep... I feel like the morale loss is not worth the 300 XP for everyone, but maybe that's just me. All right, can we pick our stadiums this week? What the heck? When do we pick our stadium? I hope I didn't miss it. I don't think I did, because we would have some kind of prompt. The Raiders are gonna end up being like the freaking Red Knights or something. All right, Niners week. They're six and four. I, yeah, I, I see you guys saying I missed it, but I've checked every week. What did it say? Um, no, it's... I didn't miss it. Next step, you'll be choosing a new team, a new name for your team. I didn't miss it. Back off, chat. Um, Richard Sherman. We'll disregard him because that's what Rodgers always does when they play. We need a win this week. A lot of upgrades. Guess that 300 XP during the bye week helped. <laughs> Nice upgrade for Amos, the punter. Ooh, we get power for doing kick accuracy. That makes sense. Both our edge guys get upgrades. Three finesse for Preston Smith. Gary. We gotta sim it. We've used up all our pledge. Come on, give us a win.